Hi and welcome to Northwest Guitars. In this video we're going to show you how to prep and spray uh, a guitar from start to finish. Uh, we've got a strap body here, uh, it's made of alder, uh, but obviously you could be make, you could be spraying anything really. Uh, ash is another popular choice. Slightly different process with ash, uh, because the grain is quite porous you'll need to use a grain filler on the body before you start to use any kind of uh, paint products. And with a, um, a grain filler you can buy it from anywhere in the UK. Uh, most sort of hardware shops sell it. Uh, it's relatively cheap, it's only about four or five pounds for a small tin uh, and it's like a putty, you just basically rub it into the body, uh, let it dry for 24 hours and then sand it smooth. Uh, it's not necessarily with alder, uh, so we can skip that step. So the first thing we're going to do is, is prep the body, sand it smooth, it's quite rough to the touch. Uh, and for that I've got some 400 grit wet and dry uh, and a sanding block. Uh, and just a cloth to, to wipe it dry. So it's basically just a case of getting a nice smooth finish. Uh, the better the prep is, the better the end result will be. The smoother the, uh, the body is at the beginning, the better the, the finish will turn out. So all I'm going to do is just go over this uh, until it's nice and smooth. Okay, so there we go. Uh, I know you can't see the difference, you might be able to hear the difference. A lot smoother than it was now it's very very smooth in fact uh, so that's ready for uh, sealing now uh, obviously like I said if you were doing this with an ash body you would have grain filled it first and then smoothed it off so it would still feel like that uh, and the next thing you want to do really is, is a couple of coats of sanding sealer uh, just to seal it what that does basically is just gives you a nice smooth surface to start uh, applying the paint to uh, even though it's grain filled you will still find that some of the paint products will soak into the body so a few coats of sanding sealer let that dry for 24 hours sand that smooth again then you've got a really really good finish uh, a really good sort of foundation to start spraying onto uh, 